everyone, konnichiwa minasan. So welcome to day two of our sugar cookie doll house week. Today we are going to be decorating the sugar cookie walls that we made yesterday. So one side is going to be this adorable little brick pattern and the roof tiles, and then the other side is going to be wallpaper. So for this stage, you can be as creative as you like and you can make wallpaper into any design that you like. I think that this stage is so much fun. So let's get started. So first we need to actually make the icing. So what you wanna do is place the confectioner's sugar, meringue powder, and water into a large bowl and beat it with an electric mixer for 10 to 14 minutes or until the mixture is smooth and when drizzled, it stays on the surface for a few seconds. So we're gonna be using half of this mixture for the exterior of the house and the other half is going to be used for the wallpaper. So first we're gonna decorate the exterior of the house and what you wanna do is place the white icing in a piping bag fitted with a small round piping tip. Place the three exterior walls on a flat surface and pipe horizontal lines about one centimeter apart on all three walls. Then pipe short vertical stripes between the stripes to create a brick pattern. Then pipe window panes directly onto the pink candy windows. Then you want to allow the icing to set for about 30 minutes. Then divide the remaining icing for the exterior walls into six bowls and dye them pink, orange, yellow, green, blue, and purple. Then place all of these into piping bags fitted with a round tip. Then you want to place the two roof cookies on a flat surface and pipe a rainbow scallop pattern with all six colors beginning with pink and ending with purple. Pipe shutters next to the windows on the exterior walls with the remaining pink icing by piping rectangles and filling them in. Allow these to fully set, then pipe little horizontal lines on top of the shutters with more pink icing to mimic the texture of shutters. Then you want to allow the roof and exterior walls to completely dry and harden to the touch for about 4-6 to six hours or overnight. Then once the icing on the exterior walls has fully set, flip the cookies over and place them on a sheet of parchment paper and a sheet of paper towel. And then place the interior wall on a flat surface as well. Then place the white icing for the wallpaper in a piping bag fitted with a small round tip. Pipe a border of icing around the edges of the cookies and the windows. Then allow the icing to set for about 30 minutes. Then you want to mix the remaining white icing with about 1-2 to two tablespoons of water until the icing is slightly runnier. And working with one cookie at a time, fill the cookies with the runny white icing until the inside of the borders are completely filled. Then before the icing has a chance to set, pipe on your desired pattern with the coloured icing. And so pipe on the coloured icing when the white icing is still wet, it's going to keep the icing flat and it's going to look like wallpaper. And if you'd like to add beadboard or any texture to the walls, what you want to do is allow the wallpaper to fully set for about 4 hours and then pipe vertical or horizontal stripes directly on top of the wallpaper. Then all you need to do is allow the cookies to fully set overnight and the wallpaper part is done! So thank you guys so much for watching, I hope that you liked today's video. Let me know in the description box below what kind of patterns or things that you would draw on your wallpaper because you guys are the most creative subscribers ever and I always love to hear your ideas. So definitely let me know how you would decorate your house and I will see you tomorrow because tomorrow we are going to be assembling the house. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye!